Hey, what's up? It's Jackie. Okay, so recently my car had to go into the shop and I had to take all of my valuables out, which is obviously nothing but lip gloss. So I was like astonished at the amount of lip products that I had in my car. So I thought it would be fun to share them with you because some of these things they don't even make anymore and I have like kind of a little sad spot in my heart for that because these are going to have to be tossed. Um, and the first thing, because I have three of these, <laughs> I have three of these in my vehicle and I don't know when they stopped making these, but it's been a while. These are the L'Oreal Color Juice. They're sheer, juicy um, lip gloss. I had um, one in the shade Peekaboo Clear. I had one in the shade Berry Burst, which was like, well, at one point, I think it was pink. I don't know what happened. And then this one is in the shade Candy Apple. And obviously, I got the least y amount of use out of the red lip gloss that obviously, if I'm putting on in the car, it just wasn't, it wasn't a good choice, obviously. Um, next in here, I have a couple of NYX Butter lip glosses. Um, I have the shade strawberry parfait which is like a really pretty um just like a cool toned pink yes i have something still swatched on me it is a video day my apologies and then this one is in the shade um peach cobbler and this is like a really pretty nice bright coral shade so there's peach cobbler right there. I love the formula of these glosses and they're amazing. Next, I have this plump potion. Um, this is by Physicians Formula and it's supposed to be like a plumping um, lip gloss. It is gigantic. Look at the packaging of it. Like compared to a regular size lip gloss, it's just humongous, which I guess is like kind of the gimmick of it that it's plumping but for real like I would never even have room for this in my purse but I guess in my car was the good place to be um next this is by Milani I love this color this is called nude touch it's their brilliant shine um lip gloss this is such a pretty sheer nude color with um, gold sparkles in it. How about I try to swatch on a place that's not swatched? I could have like planned for this a little bit better. As per usual. Um, so there it is right there. It is just such a beautiful like nude gloss. It gives you that sparkle, but it doesn't come off as like glittery. It just comes off as like a pretty shine love that. What is that called? Nude Touch. Um, I have two Jordana lipsticks that are somehow miraculously not melted. Um, and these are in the shades Victorian Mauve and Black Cherry. So let's see. Um, this one's a little hard to swatch. Victorian Mauve. And Black Cherry seems to be a little bit better. Victorian Mob might need to be tossed. That's Victorian Mob and that's Black Cherry. Um, I love the Jordana um, line of lipsticks and lip products in general. They're awesome. They're a sister company to Milani. And these I find in like Walgreens or Kmart also has them. I think Rite Aid also carries Jordana if I'm not mistaken, which I might be. But they're awesome and they're like two bucks a piece, so you can't be mad at that. This is also by Jordana. This is an awesome um, gloss. This is their Lip Out Loud, their LOL gloss. And this is in the shade E123. Um, it's just like a really pretty sheer coral. It's got some sparkles in it. Um, but again, this like... It doesn't come off as like super glitter, you know, Rama or anything. Um, these feel so good on your mouth. They're not sticky at all. They come in a, like a really wide range of shades. And again, they're like two bucks a piece. So who can be mad? No one. Um, this is like one of my 
Like, this is always in my car. Always, because it just goes with anything. I mean, any sort of, you know, it's just like the perfect nude lip gloss. Um, this is the Rimmel Stay Glossy in Endless Night. Um, now, this claims to last six hours on your mouth. Uh, no. No, no, no. Nowhere close does it do that, but that is that shade right there. It's just such a beautiful nude shade. They're not sticky at all. They're not very long lasting. I mean, really, the claims of six hours is like ridiculous, but they're comfortable on your mouth, and I like them, and they're like five bucks a piece. Um, next is this Revlon Color Stay Overtime Lip Color. This is in the shade Stay Current. So this is like one of those double-ended things. This I know is wicked old. Like, okay, yeah, I can't even swatch it for you because look at it, it's like all separated. This might be like a decade old. I know, I'm terrible. But it's like this little two-part system. You put the, you know, this part on your lips and it kind of, you know, sets on your mouth and then you top it with the gloss and it doesn't remove your color or anything. It just keeps it shiny and wearable. And I actually really like that. Um, and this is also, Something that I was actually missing having in my makeup room because it was in my car. And again, it didn't melt, which is like miraculous. Um, this is the Revlon Color Burst Lip Butter in the shade Red Velvet. This is such a nice wearable red. If you girls are looking to like dip your foot into red, um, try this shade. It is so pretty. It is so comfortable in your mouth. It feels like... Um, a balm, like a lip balm on your mouth. It feels like chapstick, but it's, you know, it's got the beautiful color to it. These are not extremely long wearing. They don't claim to be, but, you know, it's not something that like, runs off your mouth as soon as you put it on. Um, is that it? Yeah. So, seriously, that was the amount of stuff that I pulled out of my vehicle. I can't... I mean, how many lips do I have? Seriously. I mean, come on. So that's what happens. I usually take it out there and it gets left in the door or the glove box or the center console or something. I just wanted to share that with you because I thought that was super random and I was kind of shocked by the amount. So I hope you guys have a great day and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.